Before we get into today's video, I've got three things for you. Number one, if you want to get a notification whenever we post a new video, make sure you ring that bell. Number two, there's a TCG Player affiliate link in the show notes. After clicking that link, every purchase you make on tcgplayer.com helps support this channel. Number three, you'll also find a link to our Patreon where you can support us directly. Now, kick back and enjoy the show. What's up, Spikes? Welcome back to another Thursday with us. Today we're bringing you a competitive game, uh, and we're playing some old favorites because uh, a, a friend of the show, Anthony, uh, at Listener Elf on Twitter, uh, I guess a while ago at this uh, point, but uh, for us, Gen Con happened recently, and uh, he met up with Jan there. Jan's not on the show today, but... Uh, he's, he's not with us. Yeah. <laughs> he's with us in spirit. Um, he made us these neat tokens uh, type things for some of our favorite commanders. So I'm playing Xur the Enchanter, and I'm going to put up... The, the actual token? Yeah, this, the th this is what he made for me for Xur the Enchanter. I'm playing Xur the Enchanter today. Are you playing Zerd the Enchanter today? Yes. Weird, because I'm playing Brea, the Ethereum Shaper today. Um, I'm going to tell you what my character is in case you don't recognize it from the art. Uh, he did it as a rendition of Yennefer from the Witcher series, one of my favorite series of all time. Uh, it's my Brea list, so yeah. Uh, my, my, mine's Ganondorf. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to be playing my Najila Flash Hulk deck, which I'm sure uh, everyone at the table and also watching this video is sick of at this point. But uh, I have this really cool warrior token, and it's Little Mac, and he's beating up Ryu. And I'm going to hopefully beat up these guys like Little Mac is beating up Ryu. I'm just going to punch him. <laughs> go punch him. Go Real punch. hard. <laughs> yeah, and I'm playing Nathan the Paint Artist. Uh, this is uh, Sans uh, Paradox Engine for obvious reasons. Uh, mine is actually Dark Pit. Um, so one of the things that uh, that Anthony asked us was, uh, do you guys uh, play Smash? And a lot of us do. Jerry doesn't, which is why his isn't a Smash character, but Elliot's main is Ganondorf, Bill's main is uh, Little Mac, and mine is Dark Pit. Um, so just in true Smash fashion with Dark Pit, I'm going to um, probably do a lot of things, but not kill anybody. <laughs> side, side B. Side B. He's going to side B. Electroshock. Over uh, and over. With that, we're going to get started. Yeah, I'm going first, uh, so I will draw a card for my turn. And you know, it just it just isn't a game of Magic the Gathering this weekend. If you don't go turn Come one, on, Snow Remora. Covered Island, yeah, okay. Mystic Remora. Okay. Oh, Elliot, I like your I like your thinking. Uh oh. I'm gonna pass the turn. I'm gonna draw a card. I'm gonna play Volcanic Island. I'm gonna tap one and I'm gonna play Mystic Remora. That's a better turn one play than what you That have. is because well uh, actually it's no, not. This trigger my Mystic Remora. <laughs> yep. I will draw a card. <laughs> <laughs> go. He's got access to red, though. I'm going to draw. You don't. How's that feel? All right. Uh, uh, fine. I'm going to have a very, very similar turn one play. Uh, you guys have seen this before. I'm going to go forest into Avacyn's Pilgrim and pass. <laughs> Neither of us get to draw cards. Yeah. That's really sad. I will draw cards. Dummies. <laughs> I'm going to play a Volcanic Island, mm -hmm. and I'm going to pass the turn. Uh, I'm going to untap. Uh, I'm going to put an age counter on this, and I'm going to pay one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to draw a card for my turn. Uh, I'm going to play... A snow covered swamp. And I'm gonna pass the turn. I'm gonna untap. I'm gonna put an age counter on my Mr. Nomura. <laughs> and uh I'm gonna pay one for it. Mm. This is good, we can reuse these animations. <laughs> <laughs> We're just creating assets. Yeah. I'm gonna play a scrub lenders land for the turn and pass. Alright. He has all four of his colors. Yep. I'm gonna draw. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, I'm gonna play this plateau. And then I think I'm just gonna roll out this Kazali Pride Mage. <laughs> uh, and I'm going to smack Jerry for two in the face. Oh, Jerry. Uh, triggering Exalted, of course, which is why uh, he, he gets hit for two, and then oh. I pass the turn. I didn't even get to draw off my Mystic Remora. I'll draw a card. I did. I'm down to 38. I think I'm just going to play this till Area West tapped and pass the turn. Uh, I'm going to untap. I'm going to put a second counter, uh, age counter, on my Mystic Remora, and I'm going to pay two. <laughs> Uh, and then I'll draw a card. I'm very okay with this. <laughs> I'm going to play uh, a snow-covered island, and I'm going to pass the turn. I'm going to untap. I'm going to... Yeah, it's, it, mine's gone. I won! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to draw a card. Interesting. I'm going to probably uh, do a lot of things. Mm. 
So, so Elliot's going to draw a bunch of cards, is what you're saying. I like that. I don't. You wouldn't. Mm-hmm. I'm going to play a Chromox. <sighs> Trigger. Trigger. Not paying any of these. Draw. Oh, any right. of these? Any of Jerry, these. Jerry, you need to think about what you're doing. I am thinking about what I'm doing. You're not. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to imprint uh, Brainstorm. Okay. And taps mm-hmm. for a blue. Uh, next. Next. I'm going to... That doesn't work, Jerry. That does not work like the way we want it to work. That is kind of sad, but also it's fine. I don't I'm going to get pro paying two life, targeting Elliot, so he draws a card first. Uh, so you go to 36. I'm going to trigger Mr. Gamora and draw a card, uh, and then uh, you may look at my hand. He's got a whole lot of do nothing. I'm not going to lie. Cool. So attacking you is the play. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Next, I'm going to tap three mana, and I'm going to windfall. Ooh, triggering oh, Mr. Grimora. This is totally fine. Uh, yeah, I will trigger Mr. Grimora. Draw a card. I have no effects to windfall. No effects. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Uh, I have ten cards in my hand. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to be discarding Silence, Walking Ballista, Dimmer Signet. I'm discarding Mana Crypt, Carrion Feeder, Brainstorm, Derevi, and Bane of Progress. You guys are going to be happy about this. I'm discarding Magus of the Moon, Cyclonic Rift, Mana Vault, Mox Opal, Back to Basics, Power Artifact, and Anger of the Gods. I'm Woo! Discarding Torpor Orb, Ponder, Underground River, Frantic Search, Mana Vault, Felwar Stone, Azorius Signet, Ancient Tomb, Silence, Scrubland. That's so many cards. We'll draw ten. Draw ten cards. All righty. So we each just drew a bunch of cards. So <laughs> ten, uh, to be exact, we'll uh, we'll put the game on to high fast alert. Yep. yep. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I want that. Um, I'm gonna move to discards because even in ten cards, can't find land. Nice. <laughs> nice. I like that. I like that a lot. Well, I'm glad you guys do because uh, I don't. I'm glad we do too, and yeah. I'm also glad that you don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to discard Is It Charm, Chase Wielder of Mysteries, and Finale of Promise. Alright. Alrighty. My turn? Yep. I'm on tap. I'm going to draw a card. Hmm. Uh, I'm going to play a Scalding Tarn, I believe. And I'm going to crack it going to 39. Alright, off of my Scalding Tarn, I'm going to get a Tropical Island. Probably a really great destination. Uh, I, you're not wrong. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to tap these two for green and a white, and I'm going to cast Bloom Tender. Hmm. Ooh. And then I'm also going to cast Deathrite Shaman. Nice. Hmm. Playing around the, this Mystic Remora perfectly. Yeah, I'm sad about it. Yeah, you should be. Uh, move to combat. Attack. Jerry for three. Why me? Because <laughs> you suck. <laughs> Oof. 33. And uh, I will move to discard, discarding Kiki Jiki Mirror Breaker. Mm-hmm. Kiki Jiki Miki Biki. I'm good. Okay, fall on tap. Draw card. I'm going to play this Misty Rainforest. Wow, this is only turn three. Some stuff's happened so far. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to crack the Misty Rainforest. Go to 39. I'm going to get this basic island. How basic of you? I'm going to uh, cast a spell as though Jerry had never said that. <laughs> Please. It's a lotus paddle. Uh, can, trigger him. Do it, do it, do it, do it. I will do it. Don't feed the fish. Don't feed the fish. Burp. Squirm and nerp. <laughs> Then I'm going to tap an island. Hmm. No. I'm going to pass the turn, uh, discarding two cards. Those two cards will be Inventor's Fair and Verity Circle. Verity Circle, interesting. I think that's the most fair Inventor's Fair has been. Being uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm going to untap. Uh, in my upkeep, I'm going to put a third age counter on this and never pay for it. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Uh, I will draw a card for my turn. Uh, I'm going to play a Polluted Delta, uh, and I'm going to fetch down a 39. Off of my Polluted Delta, I'm going to get a Tundra. That's not a basic land. Nope. You're not a basic land. 
He he isn't. He's I, Bill LePage. I cannot argue that. So, uh, we have a saying here at the Spike Feeders. Oh. Um, and I, I believe it goes a little something like, what are we doing? We pass the turn? If we're not <laughs> passing uh, <laughs> going for it. You heard him. He's passing the turn. Uh, so I'm going to tap this swamp, uh, and I'm going to try to cast dark a dark ritual. ritual. Yep. Um, he's casting it. No, I, I have a response. Oh, that's oh, that's... fair. Everybody's got seven cards in their hand. I'm so, mental uh, messed up it. Uh, for life, trapezio mental thirty-one. Who's that? Uh, yes, my dark ritual is very countered. Can't counter the ad nauseum. Can counter the dark ritual. <laughs> that's uh, righty. You you activated my trap card. It's gonna be a high uh, I'm gonna tap this snow covered island to cast soul ring. Damn. Whoa. Any nice. vests. Ah, got him. Uh, I'm going to tap this soul ring uh, to cast a talisman of dominance. Goodness. Mm-hmm. Any effects? Nope. Nope. Uh, I'm going to tap three, uh, not paying a life into this talisman of dominance, to cast Ristic Study. Hmm. Any effects? Nope. Nope. I have nothing. Okay. I'm going to cast War of Invention X equals 1. X equals 1. I have no response. Nope. That's fine. Okay. Okay, I'm going to get a Soul Ring. Directly into play? Directly wow. into play. Holy this card moly. is powerful. And you got to tap the Lotus Petal for mana I because know. of Improvise? Well, right. oh, that's awesome. It didn't tap it for mana. It, like, did, though. It tapped for 1 mana. <laughs> it taps to cheapen out. Yeah, I'm going to pass priority on Aristic Study. Alrighty, there's Aristic Study in play. There is. And uh, I now have seven cards in my hand, so I will pass the turn. Mm -hmm. Hey, Bill, you want to destroy his Aristic Study? Not really. Okay, cool, I'm going to make him draw a bunch of cards. That's your your problem, not mine. (laughs) That's my prerogative. I was hoping that that you'd you'd get that. Yep. (laughs) Pretty sure that song came out before you were born. (laughs) A lot of things did. (laughs) I would say most things. I'm going to play uh, a Talisman of Progress. Uh, trigger. How many cards you got in your hand? Seven. 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 We all do. Yep. Except for me. Cast and Windfall again? I have six because I cast War of Invention. X equals one. <laughs> to find the Soul Ring directly from my library while tapping a Lotus Petal for Improvise. <laughs> no, I'll... Uh, I can't use this Talisman, no. can I? Not to pay the one. Yeah, not to pay the yeah, one. Because it's, it's on the stack. It. It's on the stack currently. Mm-hmm. I won't pick the one. I will draw a card. I'll pass the turn. <sighs> Jerry. I will untap. I will draw a card. Oh, that's kind of nice. Uh, I'm going to play this Flooded Strand, and I'm going to crack it going to 38. So off of this Flooded Strand, I'm going to get an Underground C. Hmm, that's pretty good. And I think I'm going to be pretty fair about this. Mm. Uh, I'm gonna tap this for three mana. Uh, so That's not really fair. Abzan. Yeah, Abzan. <laughs> uh, and then using one, and then I'm gonna pay the one off of Ristic Study. Uh, I'm gonna cast Soul Ring. Uh, what color uh, would you like to remain floating? It does not matter, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> let's say uh, green. Mm. Uh, and then with the green, I'm gonna use the green uh, to pay for the Ristic Study. Uh, so for four total, I'm going to cast Najila. Ah, very good. Mm. Then, actually, you know what? I think we we at the Spike Feeders have a saying. Uh-oh. Um, Didn't I say this? <laughs> what are we doing if we are not going for it? Can I still do that if I do the thing? I think so. Pretty sure. Um... So for a black, I'm going to cast Reanimate, targeting Derevi in my graveyard. Pass oh. Uh, I have a uh, Rhystic Study trigger. Are you paying the one? Yes. Uh, then I have no effects. <laughs> um, sure. Okay. Okay. Pass priority. Okay. All right. Um, so Derevi is going to enter the battlefield, and you're going to lose three life. You're going to lose three life. Down to thirty-five. And uh, you have a Derevi trigger, I and your reanimate is not a permanent. I'm going to untap my balloon tender. That's really strong. Uh, I'm going to 
Oh, now the bloom timer taps for five mana because Drabi's blue. And Sheila's red. Yeah. Uh, white, blue, black. Yeah, you've got it. Red, yeah. green. Yeah. Uh, so I will move to combat and I will attack Jerry with Kazali Pride Mage. Uh, trigger exalted. Yep. Uh, I will activate Najila uh, to untap my Kazali Pride Mage and give it uh, Trample, Lifelink, and Haste. Sure. And trigger Derevi. And trigger Derevi uh, sure. to untap my Blue Tender. Sure. Uh, and Jerry goes to 28, Bill goes to 38. Uh, none of us have creatures. Yeah, I was <laughs> going to say. Uh, uh, okay, do it again. Yep, I will attack you again for four this time. I have a response. Okay. How much did I take the last time? Three. Three. Three, Three and then four. So I'm at 28. Yep. Mm-hmm. Well, I guess I'd have to. Um, that doesn't work. That's unfortunate. Um, um, I'm going to tap uh, Talisman of Progress for blue. Mm-hmm. Okay. At 27. Yep. And I'm going to play a Thought Scour. Mm-hmm. I'm going to target... Trigoristic uh, Study. Trigoristic oh, yeah. Study. I'm not oh, paying right. for it. Yeah. Slaughter packed. No dice. <laughs> yeah. I was hoping that'd work. I'm going to target uh, me. Okay. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Mox Opal. Hey, the looting. Draw a card. Okay, cool. Yeah. You got it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so that is a loop. Yeah. Oh, can you describe what you're doing? Yes. Uh, so I'm going to be attacking with Kazali Pride Mage, triggering Exalted each time because it's the only creature that's attacking. Uh, and then I'm going to be using Bloom Tender to uh, activate Najila to untap the Kazali Pride Mage. When the Kazali Pride Mage deals combat damage, Derevi triggers untapping the Bloom Tender, which taps for five mana. Uh, so I'm able to. Oh, and it gives life link too. It, it does give life. So you actually gained three life on the last iteration. Yeah. yeah. No, no, I had it already. No, no, no. Yeah. So I'm going to be gaining a bunch of life uh, yeah. if this doesn't end up going through. But. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, you guys, that's game. Yeah. No, I'm I super dead. Yeah, uh, just I had um, death slowly. I had a double scepter line. Ooh. with muddle. Woo. Um, the problem is I needed more mana rocks, so I was going to trinket mage for mana crypt the next turn. That's why I um, word for soul ring and not for mana crypt. Yeah. Um, because I even had the top to draw my deck, but then the Ristic study bunged that up. Because uh, every time I cast one of them, you would draw a card. Mm-hmm. And I would only draw one, you would draw two, because I have the two scepters. Right. Just so, out. It's a May. It is a May. You can just draw, like, he just He just goes until time. he draws his deck, and then when I go to cast my finisher, he just counters it. That's fair. So. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I uh, maybe got a little greedy there. If the Dark Ritual had resolved, I had uh, Jace plus Demonic Consultation. <laughs> um, but then I also wanted to get all this mana down because I had Demonic Tutor plus Angel's Grace. Uh, nice. And then I had uh, two lands, swords, Limdol's Vault, Windfall at the end there, but I was tapped out. So um, I could have attempted to counter, which doesn't matter because Bill would have countered it. Yeah, um, I did have a Dovin Suido. I could have attempted to counter... Had I, we known that I I didn't know this was going to win the game. Uh, so I had the Thought Scour, and in my hand I also had Vampiric Tutor. Mm. So I could have mm, yeah. Force Willed it with one of my blue cards. Yeah. Um, but I just I just plain forgot that Derevi was in his graveyard, to be honest with you. Yeah, was, I didn't uh, remember. Yeah. Yeah. And then my line, if it got back to my turn, was uh, Vampire Tutor, which is why I didn't pay for the one, is relevant, because I had, this was my, ol- my only black source, mm. so I could Vampire Tutor for Isochron Scepter, and then oh, attempt to Isochron Scepter on my turn. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. yeah, well. Yeah. yeah uh, it's a quick one. Yeah, interestingly, uh, not only did none of us play our <laughs> nice, cool commanders, <laughs> but Bill didn't, 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 didn't even make... Uh, warrior tokens. Also, yeah, okay. I just want to say this has proven to me yet again that it doesn't matter if you pay or don't pay Mystic Study, Najil is going to win anyway without Mystic mm, Study. Yeah, true. Big, <laughs> big if true. I mean, it like does though. It it like actually super matters. But nope, doesn't no, matter. It like actually super matters. I'm never uh, <laughs> not paying for it. No, this is not the lesson that we yeah. wanted you to learn. Never, I'm I, never paying for it. It like actually super super matters. Look at these tokens. Though. Yeah, they're really nice. Uh, again, shout out to Anthony at You're gonna see them We'll put them up again yeah. right now, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> mm-hmm. all four, all of them. <laughs> there was there was a couple others too, but uh, yeah, maybe, maybe we'll, we'll show them off uh, in another game. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Because, uh, I mean, obviously, we all like playing these decks, and now we have these neat uh, what are versions called? of Yeah, them. I guess yeah. just alternate arts. Yeah, yeah they're like they're proxies, proxies, right? Yeah. Alternate art proxies. Yeah. But yeah, thanks for joining us once again, and uh, we'll catch you next time. Yeah.
Hey, thanks for checking out the Spike Feeders on YouTube. If you're not subscribed yet, make sure you click the subscribe button and you can click this link to check out our other great videos.